My name is Fisogo Slimbuto, and today I'll be taking you through some of the highlights from our Redefined Company Update Report. So just on the summary side of things, so we maintain our buy recommendation with an intrinsic value of 4 and 60, um, and an upside of about 18%. Our thinking is divided into three parts. The first being uh, focused a little bit more on the balance sheet. So the interest curve and gearing have remained relatively stable over the past four years. Um, we've been in a higher interest rate environment and with property being a very leveraged industry, we get that refinancing risk. Um, that's where the interest cover uh, being stable starts becoming a lot more important. Second part of our thinking is more in relation to the relationship between bond yields as well as our property performance. I'll show you a nice chart uh, where it looks like it looks at uh, what the performance redefined was from our previous um, company updates which is around October, um, as well as what the performance looks like now to sort of see that the thesis there is uh, playing up a little bit more. Um, and we anticipate that to continue um, as we anticipate the interest rates to also get a cut, which should impact bond deals and positively impact um, property performance. And in this case, we redefine. And the final final point being property fundamentals, it may be at a turning point. So we're seeing a little bit of improvement from a rental reversion side, which speaks a lot to demand. Um, and also seeing the uh, uh, vacancies stabilizing as well and then what would really change our minds would be a deterioration in the property fundamentals so a detraction in in demand momentum for property space as well as an outlook change to government bonds increasing as opposed uh, to decreasing <laughs>